back in 2017 when I started my video company, I thought that clients were going to come running in. <laughs> they didn't. <laughs> Nobody knew of my existence. <laughs> but then, then I discovered this method. And when you looked again, I found myself producing over 45 videos in five different countries. Just under two years. Welcome, That Brand Film Uploading from South Africa. And today, I'm going to show you how you are going to land your first client. Sticky note, life advice. Become a hunter. Now, I know. As creators, we want to shy away from becoming relentless animals stalking their prey. But... If you think of it like this, if you do not hunt, you do not eat. I've never truly been a believer in a showreel. I just never have. I know it's very effective, don't get me wrong. But I never thought that a showreel is going to show my potential, my storytelling potential. So I started doing something different. I started designing them for a specific target or a specific client. Great question. Story time. When I, when I started my business, I had no work to show. I've only done videos for other companies. I've never done videos for myself. So I couldn't show that work. And a dear friend of mine suggested I make a video with him. He's an ambassador for a sports supplement brand. They had a new pre-workout. So I thought, why not? I've literally got nothing to lose. We produced the video. We sent it to the head of marketing loved it he's like we're gonna collaborate boom and i thought wow this is gonna be my enter into the big leagues into the big games and then nothing happened until 14 months later and you know what i was so thankful for that friend mr fagan who planted that seed because that was the first step to major discoveries. It opened many other doors for me and I learned one thing. I learned that it's easy to grab attention. The difficult part is, is to create that need for you. You know, as a creative, I firmly believe that we need to work with brands and we need to find brands that we can resonate with. And I cannot stress this enough because as creatives, we experience so much more investment from within if we work with brands that we resonate with and ultimately the brands that we can grow with. Once you've found that brand that you resonate with, it becomes so much easier to creatively solve problems for that brand. And that's exactly what any client needs, is they need creative problem solvers and that is why we do what we do. One of my fellow creative friends, they call me George, he does weddings and corporate videos. So when it comes to creating content for his personal Instagram page and just actually just creating content for the satisfaction of creating content, he leans more towards shoes and lifestyle, clothing. And Every now and again, him and I, we get together and we create videos like this. Then after we made that one video, possible clients started contacting him, like wanting to collab and do things like that. And more and more eyes started going to his personal page, which is great because now he gets this opportunity to expand his business to something more of his personal liking. So really finding that brand you can resonate with will force you to instinctively and innately become better. Let's say for instance, you're into sneakers and you really want a shoe brand to be one of your clients. Order a pair of shoes and wait for the shoes to arrive. When the shoes do arrive, shoot an unboxing video similar to this one.
example, you can do something simple with a product like this. Or let's say you want a clothing brand. Do something like this. See, these things are all fairly simple and easy, but it's enough to just draw attention. My thing is, you don't want to overproduce this first video that you're giving away for free. You want to show enough capabilities for them to come for more. You want to show them that with budget, there's some interesting and spicy stuff coming. Now people, written language is not dead. No, I still believe this is one of the most effective ways to build a relationship in business. There is a hotel, Element House, in South Africa, where this place is like an art museum. The whole collection of art in this hotel is one of South Africa and Africa's most expensive collection of art in one place. What are the chances that I can be able to create a video there? So, I wrote them a mail. As a creator, I get inspired by just reading your home page. And I can imagine that the amount of inspiration that comes from just walking in your hallway must be any artist's dream. I told them I have to walk these halls. I have to experience what all these artists are experiencing in such close proximities. I can imagine what a muse this would be for me as a creator and then hopefully you can benefit from my experience that I have at your hotel. And they came back to me and they were like, this is amazing, we would love if you can do this. So some advice on how to write this letter. You have to make it about them, but also you have to make it more about you and how they influence you. And for any creative, if a brand influences that creative in a positive way, only the brand can benefit from that. Post that video. Then, combined with that beautiful love letter of yours, you put that in a mail. You try and arrange the next step with them. Now, what is the next step, you ask? Great question. The next step is either a meeting, it's either a pitch, it's either a Zoom call, anything that can bring you closer to whatever it is you desire. I like to go in with a plan, not for one singular outcome, but something that has a little bit more longevity to it. What happens a lot of the time is, is that bigger clients or bigger companies make use of agencies. So always when you research about the brand and how to get a hold of them, just see if you can find if they are under a creative agency. Thank you guys, I hope you found this video helpful. I must say, I am truly impressed with the amount of subscribers that we gained last week. Thank you so much guys, appreciate that. I, I, I like this, I like the fact that people are here and people are willing to learn. And more videos and more content like this will hit your screen pretty soon. Please tune in next week where I will do another oddly weird but cool video. Cool. <laughs> All right, cool. Thank you.